Good morning, Cyber Traders. Happy Friday, everybody. Good to see you all on this 24th day. Uh, what is this? What do we kind of call it? Uh, well, Memorial Day Eve. Good to see you, Grant. Good to see you, Brian. Rich, everyone. Michael, Donna, Chuck. Good to see you, Ben. And all good to see you. All right, guys. So got a lot going on this morning. I don't know by where you are, but it is absolutely gorgeous here in New York. Awfully very windy. Always like to tell you what the weather is. I'm not being the weather man, but the thing is this. Weather has a lot to do with trading. And when you get a day like today, um, it's not just the weather is uh, beautiful. We know that this is, the, this is technically the start of summer. So um, you guys are probably all familiar with the Hamptons over here in New York. It's where everybody pretty much goes, all the billionaires. And, you know, it's, you, you probably see it all over TV and everything like that. Um, Kids are off from school. A lot of schools are off today. So a lot of people probably left yesterday. So, you know, it's going to be a kind of a little difficult of a, of a morning here uh, going into today's open. Even, even though that market is up, what are we up, 130 points right now. You know, even though we're up, I'm not seeing a lot. I mean, we did trade. I know Ben made some money on uh, Foot Locker on the short. I made a little money on this OTLK that moved. Um, a couple of other, other stocks. Let me bring those up when I got over here. I got the wrong damn stock up here. Is the Foot Locker uh, took a big hit right there, and the OTLK right there. That's the one that I kind of jumped in earlier. But um, but other than that, uh, yeah, Ben made uh, what forty forty five cents on that. All right, let's give him a round of applause. You made more money than me, Ben, on that OTLK. I don't know how many shares you traded. I mean, it's not about remember. It's always about points, guys. Remember, everyone, we don't talk about one of the big things that we always do here, and I always want to remind everybody. We never brag about how much money we make because we don't want to discourage new traders to advanced traders. So we always talk about how much more on points because 45 cents could be 100 shares, 1,000 shares, 10,000 shares. But the goal is we're only focusing on making that amount of points. It's a, you know, once you get used to it, you just all you got to do is add more shares to it. So, um, but over, overall, uh, there was one nice stock that we did trade yesterday that I just want to bring up, the MAXR. That was basically the big winner of the day right there. Uh, that stock just came out. You could see it right around 130. It just popped. It just, I guess it was just news came out on it. But thing just popped from um, $7, went all the way to 8 and just kind of died. Kind of built a little bit of a Fausta flag. Had a couple of little nasty shakes here. But overall, that was probably one of the really nice ones that did come out. What was the news on that? Um, oh, yeah, here it is. Uh, Josh just gave it to me. Uh, Matrix Technology Sector by NASA to develop a... Uh, demonstrate power communication capsules for NASA Lurie Gateway. I know they just launched a, um, I know that it was just a, a rocket that was launched yesterday. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but I guess uh, NASA news is big. All right. Anyway, what's going on this morning? What we're looking at? Just guys, be very, very careful of today's market. Okay. Because, like I told you, it is gorgeous here. It's awfully windy. I know we had a couple of tornadoes that did hit. You know, um, got to be careful of those. It's coming, you know, the wind's coming up over here. So, you know, um, other, but other than that, it is pretty here. And uh, I know a lot of people are going to be cu cutting it short because Monday we are closed. Everyone remember that. It is Memorial Day. I always kind of remind everybody. And once again, let's, let's give a big round of applause to our veterans because it's not, it's just not the start of summer. It is actually, it's a remembrance of our veterans. So let's give them all. Actually, let me give them a good electric guitar. How about that? A big, big, uh, big uh, thank you for all that. All right, so with that, you should be careful going on to this morning with trading. I mean, there are a couple of good stocks. Be careful of, uh, of Foot Locker. You could see it's got a big spread. There's not a lot of tier sizes on it. Uh, you got to be a little bit more an advanced trader. So I'm going to probably give this more of a five, more than a four, more than a one. But uh, the, one, the only one I thought was more of a something everyone could afford to trade and I traded it and I, I, I got a little, I, I thought it was going to pop on me, but it didn't. Um, let me show you better on the one minute chart. It had a really nice move here. I thought it was going to go and break a higher high, but it just kind of died right here. The stock was a $10 stock, took a very big hit. We traded a couple of days ago, uh, less than, I don't know what about a week or two weeks ago, had a really nice pop right there, but she backed right off. Thought she was going to make it. I don't know. She could pop at nine thirty. So, but we're going to throw that in a watch list. BIOC, 
Another little cheap little stock. A lot of you remember this stock. It went from a dollar to two dollars. Another hundred percent. We even traded back in January. It went from a dollar all the way to three fifty. Got some good volume, good spread, decent. You know, she's up about one hundred seventy thousand shares, up seventy percent. A lot of volume there in the matrix. You know, not not. I'm not completely sold on it, but you know what it is. What it is. This is what you have to expect when you go into a day like this. So, I mean. We could look at a couple of brand name stocks out there, but I mean, listen, there's really not that much out there. Even if I'm looking over here in the bottom left-hand corner, when I'm looking at the big percentage gainers on the TradeStation platform, I mean, you're talking 16 cent stocks. I mean, you know we're not going to trade any of these things. It's all garbage. All right. I mean, you have this one right here. The the, the it's up 10 percent. W K H S. But she kind of like died. I mean, she was up big uh, yesterday in the after hours. She kind of died right there. So there's not a really a lot going on right now. And and you know what? That's okay. That's okay. Because this is how you learn when to trade and when not to trade. Just always remember, everyone, not every day is a trading day. We know how Mondays and Fridays work. But this Friday is a little bit more of the extreme. So just be very, very careful. Uh, Fran says uh, about the pot stocks. I mean... Drones, they're not really doing anything. All the pot stocks are pretty much dead, friend. And I, I didn't see anything that looked pretty good out there. There's a TRLY, is another one. TLRY. Yeah, I mean, this is a big one right here. Not really doing anything. Any thoughts on IBN? I mean, it's gapped up pretty big right here, but I would probably say I will stay away from it. We don't really trade stocks like this. Uh, when we, you could see how they're very gapped in, in the long term chart, when they all it does is gap up and it just stays flat. So that's really pretty much my thoughts to stay away from those. Let me just be careful of that, Brian. All right, all right, guys. So listen, does it mean that we're out of business today? No, no, absolutely not. Because we see what happens at nine thirty. Just that shows you there's really not that much going on pre market. We talked about earnings yesterday in our, in our, in our class. We, t we talked about how many companies came out with earnings yesterday. But today, I mean, it was a seven. Nobody comes out with earnings on Friday. All right. Um, and typically, sometimes a little bit more on Monday. But just what it is, what it is. So just be very careful out there. And you know what? If there's nothing going on in the morning, go enjoy yourself. Enjoy the long weekend. Go buy the lobsters before they sell out. Listen, this is what you train for. This is not a full-time job. Imagine if there are people who have to stick around and be there till five o'clock until you know to uh, for work all day. Here we are. We can come and go into our please. Listen, there's times when to train, there's times when not. Today's probably one of those days that are not. And give remember that's okay. All right, guys. But let's see what happens at the open. But we'll be here all day, and we'll and we'll be here going to the close. So, but uh, listen, Friday afternoons are always good. You know that sometimes companies have to come out and trade and. Um, you know, and, and they came out with news. So sometimes for, if we get a good mover in the afternoon, let me tell you, they're, they're probably the easiest ones to trade going into any day. All right, guys. Good luck, everyone. Happy trading. And if I don't see you in the afternoon, enjoy your long weekend. And once again, vets, thank you very much for your, um, your service.